Hey guys, welcome to a new vlog. It is Friday, December 9th, and I have a very busy day. Very busy next couple days, actually. Very busy week, very busy life right now. I just got home from running a bunch of errands. Actually, the first thing I did was I went and signed a lease because I'm moving again. I know, insane. I don't wanna to talk too much. I don't wanna spoil too much because I'm gonna do a lot of moving content, but I'm moving. But I went and signed my lease this morning. And I'm so excited because I hate this place. I'm just gonna be honest. I hate this apartment so much and I wanna leave and I'm leaving. So yeah. Anyway, um, after that I went to the city and I checked out the new Stodd New York store. I got some goodies there, I'll show you guys later. And the team is so sweet and they honestly have so many cute pieces for the holiday season so I really recommend you guys go check that out. And then after that I went to the MEJ Ski Club pop-up that's on Elizabeth Street in New York. By the time this video is up, it'll be done. But I'm posting on my stories about it on Instagram. If you guys aren't already, check me out on Instagram for more real-time updates. Met the girls there, also so sweet. It's so nice going to like events and meeting the owners and the teams and everything because it's great to put a name to a face and like really get to know them on a personal level. So yeah, that was super fun. They're doing amazing, so many cute things there. And then I just came home and I need to organize my life because I'm getting on a plane tonight and I'm going to Paris. So I need to prep for that. I have so much shit to do. I need to clean this whole apartment. I'm very stressed. I'm getting picked up at 6.30, which is in like five hours. I'm literally out of breath. I'm just like, I'm really, I have so many jobs I need to shoot too while I'm in Paris or literally right now, to be honest, I need to shoot something right now. Oh my god, I'm literally so stressed and I have no one here to help me because my assistant went home for the holidays already. And I'm f***ed, basically. Yeah, I'm gonna try and get everything done today. So yeah, I'm gonna take you along and I'll probably start a new vlog when I'm in Paris, but this is just gonna be a little organizational video. But yeah, hope you guys are doing good. I'm doing great. I'm very grateful. I've, I've literally, like, I'm so busy in the best way, if that makes sense. Like... I'm complaining, but I'm also, like, so grateful. So I'm the type of person who I'd way rather be, like, so busy and stressed than, like, bored. You know what I mean? Mm. Yeah, I think that's my toxic trait. Okay, I have a bunch of packages here need to be opened and put away before I leave. Where did I put the box cutter? I just had it. Oh, it's here. Um, so I'm going to just sit here and show you guys what I got today as well as what's in the packages. So first, from... God. I got these stunning shoes guys like I'm so excited to wear them this holiday season they're these green like velour velvety little kitten heels with bows on it I'm so obsessed with these they're so cute little ballet-esque kitten heels and they run true to size I got a 37 I'm so excited to wear these. I'm gonna bring these to Paris with me. I'm actually gonna put them in the little baggies right now. They're so cute. They have them in like, I think a couple other colors, but these ones were my fave. So thank you, Stodd. Anything I show you guys that I can also link, I'll try and link down below in case you guys like wanna add it to your wish list last minute or something. And then also I got this top. This little bustier brown corset top. It's so flattering on. I'll probably post in it on Instagram this weekend. But it's so cute. Love. Anyway, so I got both of those. And then from MEJ, I got this black headband with little stars on it. So cute. And then I got the same one in white. Super excited to wear these. If you guys know, I wear headbands all the time. Then they were doing personalized stockings at the pop-up, so I got it with my name on it, Ruby. It's very cute. And then I also got a little MEJ teddy bear. They're so cute. I don't know where I'm gonna put him, but it's so cute. And then lastly, I got some fuzzy socks. So yeah, 
very cute thank you nj and then i got a package from coach because i'm working with them for their new y2k collection this is the bag i picked out it's this brown classic coach print little mini purse i like how the strap is actually a little longer than a lot of purses like this because like you can wear it with a coat i feel like once you add a coat on like a lot of my bags don't fit over my shoulder so i like how this one has a little more room and it's a little bit more spacious than a classic kind of like shoulder bag anyway this is really cute i think i'm gonna bring this to paris too because this would look really cute with this and the shoes that's a whole fit oh my god oh this is something i ordered okay so this is a little sneak peek but I am doing 12 days of giveaways on my Instagram, on my social media in general. Um, I'm going to be, I'm going to be posting about it on my Instagram though. Really exciting gifts for 12 days going up until Christmas. Um, so yeah, make sure you're following me on Instagram for more info on that. But one of the gifts is going to be this Dior Beauty gift set. I'm really excited for all the gifts you guys definitely want to stay tuned i'm not gonna open it because i don't want to ruin the gift wrapping but this is one of the gifts and i don't know what day i'm giving this one away but definitely follow me on instagram for more info on that it's all fun and games until you have to break down every single one of these boxes for like an hour next is a package from handover which is um pretty sure they're from Europe and they make really cute boxer shorts I wear all the time and they sent me this little PJ set oh my god so cute and then matching PJ bottoms this is so cute wow I'm bringing these to Paris too bring everything to Paris and then these PJ bottoms as well oh my god these are super cute I'm obsessed thank you so much handover I'll have their Instagram here Oh, this is a package from High Rack. This cute little floral top. I feel like it probably comes with a set. This little cute mini. That's very cute for winter. Some green sweatpants. It's actually perfect that they sent me these because I have these green like four screen sweatpants that are disgusting that i thrifted like years ago but refuse to get rid of because i love the color and they're so cozy so this might be my sign to get rid of them matching cropped hoodie little pink romper so cute for like summer oh these cute little summer boxer shorts or i guess they could be for any season Oh, these boxer shorts too so cute oh my god i love everything they also sent me i guess this is a pr agency they sent me some clay beauty products that was sweet of them thank you hi rack i just got back from mexico literally last night so it's so crazy that i'm getting on another plane tonight this has like been such a busy month for me which i'm so blessed for but also like i'm not really used to being this busy but i was like very proud of myself i was so productive on the flights to mexico and back it was like six hours like like just as long to go to paris i guess and i literally was working i edited two videos like i was working the whole time because JetBlue has really good wi-fi JetBlue is like honestly the only airline that has good wi-fi that i've had at least and that's free i feel like you usually have to pay for it and then it's even when you pay for it it's like shitty so i love JetBlue. Oh, this is from Strawberry Western. Oh my god, so cute. They wrote me a little note. Water bottles coming in a separate package. They have really cute water bottles. I'll put a picture here. And I think these are like temporary tattoos. Oh, so cute. Their card is so cute. Whenever someone writes me like a handwritten card or they have a really cool like card, I keep it. Anyway, this is from Strawberry Western, which I think is a pretty new. All right, first is... I think this is a top oh my god it could be wrong i could this could be a headband oh my god it's a hat look how cute it has little ladybugs on it oh my god oh my god look how cute this is oh are you kidding so cute 
I got these these sweatpants that have little lace details on the bottom. Very cute. Their stuff is like very cutesy. And this little like heart pocket. Sorry, that's the back. This is the front. Little cute oversized tee. Maybe I'll wear this on the plane. And I got this set that comes with, oh my god, so cute. This little skirt moment with like, it's like plaid and polka dot. I love when patterns clash so much. It's like this athletic material and has these built in like leggings underneath. I love this brand. It's like, they're so unique. And then it comes with this matching like super small like sports bra type top. So cute. I love the craziness that's going on with this brand. And then also, this is like a little like strawberry like carabiner type situation for like your keys or something. So cute. Thank you so much. This is another brand deal partnership that I need to shoot in Paris. It's from Isabelle Marron. It's for the release of their, I think it's called their moon bag. I could be wrong. It's so stunning. Like, are you kidding? Look at it. It's just gorgeous. Like, the studding and the gold hardware. And it says Isabelle Macron there. Okay, I have this big boy package here. Don't know what this is. Oh my god, I'm gonna cut my fingers off. This is a Balmain bag, which I also need to shoot because I'm working with them as well. Guys, it's actually insane. Like the brands I am working with this year, I'm like flabbergasted. Like I could not be more grateful and like I'm just like I cannot believe it. Like literally two years ago, I was living in Toronto, it was COVID, like what the f This gorgeous little Balmain bag needs to be shot too. All right, next we have a package from, I don't know how to say their name, North. These pants, nice knits, but it's this like denim wash kind of looking but cotton wide leg yoga pants and then i have the matching top they already sent me so i've been waiting for the pants super cute thank you so much oh this bag i ordered on Depop. it's this beautiful big little like i don't even know how to describe it but it has this like flower decal it's white i don't really have nice white bags so i was really excited when i saw this i snatched it up so yeah all right, last package from my Adidas family. Love them to death. First we have little cropped, oh, this is really cute, cropped zip up, half zip, and then matching little shorts. And we got some, these purple leggings with a matching little sport tank. Purple puffer. So cute. Windbreaker pants? Yeah. Love this. That is the end. I'm gonna clean up and slash packing slash shooting slash oh my god so much to do. See this is a whole thing I need to deal with. This like literally just everywhere. This is honestly I'm exposing myself but I feel like since I'm moving it doesn't really matter if I show you guys now because I'm moving into a much bigger apartment where I have room for all my shit. So that was the goal. All right, I've laid out pretty much, I think all the stuff I need to bring minus like underwear and socks and stuff. I was gonna bring just this, but I don't think that's gonna be enough. So I'm gonna bring this baboon to the moon backpack, which is my favorite backpack to travel with ever. And then also a carry on, I think. So I'm packing these handover PJ set to sleep in and just like chill in. I'm gonna try and pack a lot of my like clothes in here so that in my suitcase it's the more heavy stuff like I have to bring a whole Fendi outfit and Fendi bag to shoot because I'm packing quite a few shoes even though I'm only there for literally not even three days just because I have so many like looks to shoot I'm gonna wear these pants on the plane and I think I just might wear this long sleeve with it because if anything I can wear this as like a layer when I'm like walking around because I'm only wearing a light puffer jacket because I don't really have any winter coats here. They're all in storage. So yeah, I'm bringing these pants that I was wearing today. This Stodd corset that I can wear in the day. 
or at night. This coach bag is gonna go in the suitcase. I'm bringing this vintage Nike dress to wear with this bag potentially. And I also have these lace leggings that I thought would be really cute under this, but if I don't end up shooting it with this, then I'll shoot this separately. I also wanna have room to pack my toiletries in my bag because I like to do my skincare and stuff on the plane i'm very excited because they're flying me first class which is means i'll be able to like have the room to like spread all my shit out. i'm bringing this little outfit this vintage top that i absolutely love and then this knee-high skirt that again can be worn in the day or the night but i think this is my backup option of wearing i think this bag this might be a better option for the bag honestly i think i'll probably end up shooting with this these peachy pants to wear out. So I'm gonna go shopping probably. And then I have this look too that I'm bringing, or I don't really need to bring it honestly, but the Fancy Club pants. But the problem is with these is they're super see-through. I'm not really sure what to wear under them. I'm gonna pack a little romper workout set thing from Set Active. So I'm gonna go to like a Pilates class or something while I'm there. Tank air, tank top. Oh wait, I'm literally wearing the black one already. The other white one. All right, I'm gonna continue packing. I'll let you know when I'm all packed up. So I literally just sat on my phone for like 30 minutes. So I think I need to make some food. I'm hungry and I need energy. We have no food though, so I'm just gonna make some pasta. Easy. I love these Casterly pots. Or wait, it's not Casterly. I forget what the brand is. I included it in my holiday gift guide that I posted recently. Okay, I'm gonna clean up the kitchen while the water is boiling. get it at whole foods if you guys are interested my boyfriend says that you have to get the ones that are kind of like whitish and it's better for you opposed to the like yellow pasta i've mixed two pastas together here because they have the same cook time they were both like half empty so yeah i feel like i should just make all of it and then my boyfriend will have leftovers now i need to set a timer for seven minutes because i like my Pasta al dente. Timer set. Okay, I've pretty much finished packing. That was very stressful. I have about two hours, about two hours till I get picked up. And I'm just gonna eat my pasta I made. I put tuna in it, I'll show you after. And chill, and my boyfriend's gonna be home soon, and we're just gonna hang out until I have to leave. Yeah, my suitcases are packed to the brim. So I'm either gonna have to buy like a tote bag or like, I don't know, something if I buy anything, which I will. I should have just like brought in a big suitcase and left a lot of room, but it's too late for that. So yeah, that's where we're at. Exhausted, excited to go to Paris, but also my head is killing me, but I think I just need to eat. Yeah, okay. Okay, this is my pasta. I basically just put it in the fridge and made it like a cold tuna salad pasta. I feel like a lot of people don't like tuna. I personally love it. It's a love-hate thing I feel like for a lot of people. I love it. I'll see you guys at the airport probably. Literally just almost forgot you on my couch. I had to run from my car to get you. All right, we're headed to the airport. 